my my approach to everything in life is that I'm lazy. <laughs> so I am not going to sit there retouching an image for two hours. Okay. But I'm ambitious at figuring out efficient methods. Right. So that's that's my thing. Figuring out efficient things. You know, ever since I was a kid. Mm-hmm. So for me, editing, yes, I love editing. Everyone knows I shoot to edit. Mm. I love it. But I, I need to figure out uh, the quickest way to edit an image. So I, I figured that out. I watched every video on YouTube. It took me about... 1.2 billion years mm-hmm. but i watched every youtube video mm-hmm. on retouching and um, <laughs> i figured out the quickest methods to editing and then i took all those methods threw them into an action this action doesn't edit your image it just builds a foundation in photoshop because most of the time people are overwhelmed they open up photoshop okay now what do i do okay what steps do i need to do to start doing frequency separation dodge and burn sharpening the eyes it'll take you half an hour just to build those layers that you need so you have an action that does I have that. action boom you click it, boom, everything is right there. Now you just click, mask, click, mask, paint mm-hmm. here, paint there, boom. Mm-hmm. Your image is edited. Is there a way and, for people to get the action? Yes, I give it to everyone. You give it? Yeah. Well, I mean, well, I want it. Okay. <laughs> it's in my tutorial, and my tutorial is a third of the price it used to be because it's four years old, and I'm still using the same exact methods. Same thing, yeah. Same exact workflow. Right. But right. when I come here and speak, I'm not just going to speak, show off an action and what I do and walk away. Right. I'm going to teach you. And that's why right. I'm speaking for three hours today. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. I, and when I told people like three hours, oh my God. I've that's... done I've done five hours usually. This is the this is the hybrid version. This is the short version. This is the short version. <laughs> well, that, I'm actually really interested in that. I get what you're saying. Something that builds the foundation for you so you don't have to redo it every exactly. time. So anything that's a redundant process, so to speak, is exactly. done within the action. Then it's all set and you can customize it. I'm exactly. Assuming. Right. Well, it, it's all there, broken up, color coded, and even in the file, in the layer names, I tell you exactly which brush size, mm. flow to use, yeah. the flow and opacity and everything. Everything is there. And then I have notes also I give out that shows you and I show you in person. All right. Yeah. I got to I gotta check so it out. For me, when I'm, when I'm teaching you about retouching is not so much I'm teaching you methods. Mm. The methods and everything is so simple and broken down for you. It's something you don't have to memorize. What I'm teaching is the mindset behind editing. I think that's, I think that's what sets apart um editors and great editors um like people walking away with great edits the efficiency mindset not the efficiency mindset the efficiency mindset is a given you need that what's you, the what's the mindset the that mindset you teach? i'm teaching you is how far to go how far not to go how to create okay. edits that are clearly edits but stay natural you want to see skin details is um, it the whole a good artist knows when to stop sort exactly, of? Exactly. Okay. That kind of thing. Okay. Teaching you how to do toning that complements the skin right. and not the other way around. Because you could continue to spend hours and hours and hours yeah, and you need make to know it when, worse exactly. with you every need to, passing hour. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you need to know when to stop, basically. Okay. And, and just understanding what good skin is, what bad skin is, what good lighting on skin is. It's... It's something that people are so worried about just figuring out methods that they forget like to stop looking at the layers panel and start looking at the image. Everyone is concentrating on numbers. Hey, what number did you use for that? I'm like, don't worry about that. I have no idea what I used. I never know what I used. I'm looking at the image when I'm editing. I'm not looking at the layers panel. Right. Oh, I like that. That's some sharp criticism. Uh, it's, It's the truth. Yeah, it is. It is. Hey, guys, thanks for watching this conversation presented by White House Custom Color on YouTube. Be sure to check out our other content and click that subscribe button right there. Right. (laughs) Right there. It's there somewhere.